Hey guys, today I'm going to tell you about uh, Casita remediation number uh, 493. <laughs> I was uh, washing my trailer down and I was uh, up on the roof here. And of course this is a new 2011 trailer from October, so you really don't expect to see any dust, but what, I mean any rust. But when I looked over the side, check those out, see? Those are little screws that are just on this one side of the window here. This is the kick-out window. Um, and they didn't use stainless. So these buggers here are already rusted out. Hopefully I can get these off and I'll replace them with stainless. So this is just another little uh, annoying job to uh, remediate. Notice I don't say mod because remediate means to fix. Fix what uh, Casita did wrong here. Okay, here's the second part of this little vid on these uh, little screw replacements. We're doing the top of the breakout window on the casita. And you can see that these are all really nicely rotting out already. Thanks, casita. And uh, here's the replacement. Uh, these are actually number fours, which I had to cut the ends off with my trusty Dremel cutoff disc. I could only find them in slotted. But uh, after about 15-20 uh, minutes of playing with my Dremel, and of course I bought four, I got two. And uh, you know, this is my cutoff wheel, by the way, on my Dremel. These are uh, fiber reinforced cutoff wheel for your Dremel. Blessed be the Dremel. So now we just have to uh, wait till it stops raining so we can install. Hey guys, I'm just going to show you for a minute uh, how I'm comfortably working up here, high up on the side of my casita. And uh, I was, you know, replacing these little screws which were rusted out after three months. Um, but I wanted to show you how I'm standing up here. I'm using a uh, six foot extension ladder, but I have this little step shelf. Now this thing is really cool. Because, see, you see me bouncing on it? Okay, I'm putting a lot of weight on it, yet it's perfectly stable and really comfortable to stand on. Uh, you know, if you uh, have spent any time in a ladder rung, you know the, uh, the bottom of your foot there can get some serious uh, stress and um, there's a name for it, but uh, essentially that uh, arch area gets all stressed out of it. But uh, this pretty much eliminates the problem. This is a really nice way to work on the side of your casita up here you know you can work on the top pretty much get right up to the AC and uh, you know you've got plenty of room over here to uh, put your tools uh, this is also adjustable to any step you want to put it on and uh, I'll get off here and I'll show you how this works see so I just step on the side and I can kick this in and when it's kicked in it's right down like normal then I can put this on any step, and it allows you to stand on it. I can put it on the higher step, or a lower step, and it gives me that perfectly stable platform to put my feet on. So that's another uh, possible solution for you for when you have to work uh, high on top of your little casita.